Hi there, Spark fans. Rob Reynolds here. For a lustrum now, the LiDAR light in its many incarnations has been one of the most popular sensors here at SparkFun. Well, Garmin has released a new version and we have it. Introducing the Garmin LiDAR Light V4. The V4 has a range of 5 mm to 10 m with a resolution of just 1 mm. Its measurement repeatability, as measured to a 90% reflective target and using high accuracy mode with averaging, is plus or minus 1 cm up to 2 m, plus or minus 2 cm up to 4 m, and plus or minus 5 cm up to 10 m. It can use the I2C interface or the ANT interface and is user configurable for SPY using the Nordic SDK. Its update rate is greater than 200 Hz over I2C and up to 200 Hz using ANT. Its operating voltage range is 4.75 to 5.25 volts DC. And here's the amazing part. Its idle current consumption is a scant 2 milliamps. During acquisition, it draws 85 milliamps, which is the same as with the V3. It also houses an NRF52840 SOC from Nordic Semiconductor. This pairs an ARM Cortex-M4 processor with 1 megabyte of flash memory and 256K of RAM. The included 2.4 GHz multi-protocol radio and S340 soft device support ultra-low power wireless technologies, including Bluetooth 5 LE and ANT. This means that developers can create custom applications or use it as a standalone device right out of the box using the preloaded stock application. And all of this comes in a package that weighs under 15 grams or about half an ounce. That makes it a great choice for UAVs. Now one of the great things about the V4 is that it doesn't actually use a laser, but rather a beam of near-infrared light, making it inherently eye safe under normal usage. Now while it does communicate over I2C, it requires 5 volts. Now if you're using a 5 volt board, you're going to need to do some logic level shifting. However, I was able to throw together a really easy circuit using the SparkFun Redboard Artemis. Its pins are all 3.3 logic. I just ran the voltage into the 5 volt in on the power side of the board, and it was just that simple. With its lightweight, low power consumption, and a price that's less than half of the V3, the Garmin LiDAR Lite V4 is going to find itself a perfect fit for many of your distance and proximity sensing projects. Pick up yours over at sparkfun.com and happy hacking! But rather, a beam of near infrared light Flatlined, a little bit, just a little bit, not gonna lie. Still looking great, right? Okay. Booyah!